Jason, welcome to Charlton. How does it feel to be an Addicts player? Yeah, I'm delighted. Uh, obviously, it's been a long time coming. I've heard about the interest and uh, for a while back now, but obviously I was to and firm with a few things and I'm glad to just get it finally signed and uh, be, a, be a Charlton player. Yeah, as you say, there's been a bit of speculation over the last few weeks, a few fans excited to hear your name mentioned. How did the move come about? When did you first hear of the interest? Um, probably a week or so ago um, of the firm interest and... Obviously, once once I'd heard heard about that, it was um, an opportunity. Obviously, Charlton getting relegated, I knew they'd want to go straight, try and get straight back up. And I know it's obviously a transitional period at the club. And um, when I spoke to the manager, um, he wanted me to be part of that, and and I'm looking forward to being part of it now. Some particularly Wigan fans, I guess, may be surprised that you've opted to come back down to League One. Obviously, you're a fan favourite there by the looks of things at Wigan. What attracted you to this club? Um, just a massive club, you know, and um, the potential here is huge. Um, I'm, a, I'm a London lad, um, and obviously it was a chance for me to get back down south, closer to my family and friends, which was a big thing for me, having two kids and a wife. Like, um, so, yeah, no, everything um, all come together, and, and I'm delighted to be here. I know you've uh, played with Nicky Jose whilst at Leeds. Uh, was he a fact? Did you get a chance to speak to him before coming down here? Yeah, I spoke to him quite regularly. Uh, yeah, and he was telling me obviously what they're trying to do and about the training ground, places to live. He was, he, he was a massive help, to be fair. And, and he's going to be obviously play a massive part this year as well with the goals he scored last year. So hopefully he can replicate that. And I guess last season will prove to be an invaluable experience for you. This season with us, with our aim being to do exactly what Wigan did and bounce straight back to the championship. Yeah, um, obviously we last season we achieved promotion as, as winners, so that was a great achievement. Um, and I didn't didn't know if I, I would be sort of having to drop drop back down. Obviously, is getting myself back into the championship, but it's happened. And um, like I said, I'm delighted to be here, and hopefully um, I can help help out everyone this year with obviously the experience of, of winning the league. But I know a few of the lads here have already won League One as well, so. It's all bodes well. It must that experience lifting the trophy, things like that at the end of the season must really leave you hungry to do that again. Oh yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, no, definitely. You know, I, I want to um, do as well as I can personally in my career, um, and obviously with, with Charlton, I know the fans and, and everyone at the club will want to do the same. So, yeah, we all pull in the same direction. And Russell Slade, the manager, has spoken about having the right sort of characters at the club, he cited you as being exactly that. Do you think your character is, is your, your biggest strength that you add to the team here? Uh, I hope so. I'm a, I'm, I think I'm a, I'm a talker on the pitch, um, always trying to help help people, help the young lads. And um, Obviously, but first and foremost, you've got to get your own performance right, so I'll be working hard to get that right first and then obviously um, try and bring my leadership skills through. Um, I've, I've been captain at all, all my previous clubs, so, um, so yeah, hopefully I can bring that to the club. And finally, we, we had to bury on Saturday for opening day. How are you fitness-wise? Uh, are you expecting to maybe have a chance of going straight in or do you need a bit of catch-up? Uh, I don't know. I'm, I've, I've been working hard the last few weeks uh, to try and get myself um, sharp uh, and ready. Um, I, I'd, I'd say I'm, I'm ready, but obviously that's up to the gaffer. I'd hope to try and get into the squad. Um, whether I start or not, I don't know. Um, but I'll be uh, trying to knock on the door. Are you trained today for the first time? Must have been good to just get straight in there, meet the lads, and, and be involved. Yeah, I think that's the easiest way, you know, and sort of just going going out there, showing what you can do. And um, there's obviously some good players here, so it's going to be difficult. But um, I think a few of the people are saying we need a few more faces, but uh, with Marcel out there, some good good players. So hopefully we'll we'll be all right. Ow.